In this video, we're going to take a look at how to set reference on the DSX Cable Analyzer. It's a good idea to set reference at the start of each day when you're testing or at the beginning of each testing cycle. This will ensure you don't send the remote to the far end of the cable run only to find out you need to bring it back to set reference. A single main unit may be referenced to up to eight remote units. This includes main units running as remotes. For more information on how to use a main as a remote, check out our how-to video. This means you can have one person in the wiring closet and eight people out at the remote end. The first step is to connect the permanent link adapter to the main unit. After this, I will plug the channel adapter into the remote unit. Then I'll plug the permanent link adapter into the channel adapter. The chirp lets me know that they're both connected. Now that the main and the remote are connected together, I will tap on the Tools button from the main screen. Then I will tap on Set Reference at the top of the screen. Here we see a diagram of how the unit should be connected. I'll tap Test to begin the reference process. When the process completes, we'll hear a confirmation tone. Now that reference is complete, I can press the Home button and go back to the home screen. If you're using more than one remote, or mains configured as a remote, you'll need to repeat this process for each one of them. Be sure to check out our other videos on getting the most out of your Fluke Network's copper and fiber certification tools. For more information on the Fluke Network's Certified Cable Test Technician Program, please visit https cctttraining.com.